Okay guys, to start off this makeup I am using a very pale foundation and I'm just completely covering my face and onto my neck and a little bit on my chest. To do some contouring I am using a darker foundation and I'm doing some underneath my cheekbones, into my temples, along the sides of my nose and just some along the top of my forehead and onto my jawline just to frame my face. To seal the foundation I'm using my Ben Nye Super White Powder and I'm making sure that I put some extra powder onto my cheekbones as this does kind of have a white pigment in it so it highlights my face as well. To darken some of my contours I'm going in with a brown star blend and I'm especially going in underneath my cheekbones to give me a bit more of a gaunt look. I'm also adding a little bit of shading onto my neck and on my collarbone. Now to darken my contours even more I'm using a purple eyeshadow from Sugar Pill and this kind of helps the contours to look a little bit cooler because I don't want to have a bronzed look. Now that I'm happy with my foundation, I'm going to start doing my eyes. And I'm going to start by using this Jeffree Star liquid lipstick. If you're going to use a liquid lipstick on your eyes, you have to make sure that it is eye safe. Now using a dry brush I'm just fading out some of that color. So I want my eyeshadow to be really nice and bold and red so I'm going in with this Sugar Pill Red eyeshadow as well. Now just to make the colour a little bit deeper I'm going in with a Jeffree Star red eyeshadow and I'm just putting that in my crease and onto the corners of my eyes. For my eyebrows I'm using a brown grease makeup and then I'm just going over that with some black star blend powder and then I'm also using some of that black star blend onto my eyes as well.
for my brow bone highlights, I'm using a Ben Nye White Precision Liquid Eyeliner and I'm just fading it out. For the mask, I am using a Body Effects Baroque Mask Prosthetic and it comes unpainted, but now I've just painted it black and I'm sticking it on with some Prosade. You can also add a few details with some Tag Black just to blend it into the makeup a little bit. To add some extra detail to my eye makeup, I'm also going to be adding um, these little crosses underneath my eyes and I'm just using that Jeffree Star liquid lipstick for that again. To make the mask really pop and look really pretty, I am using this Meron Brilliant Silver and it's just a water activated face paint. And you can just put that right on top of the black and it's super shiny and it will really make the details pop out. For my lips, I'm using that Jeffree Star liquid lipstick again. So now I've also put in some red contact lenses. These ones are called Dracula. And to make my eyes look kind of bloody and shiny, I'm using a bit of clear gloss just like a lip gloss and I'm putting that over top of my eyeshadow and then finishing it off with some mascara. And then that's the makeup all done. So it's quite a subtle look if you want to go that way this Halloween. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it and I'll catch you guys next time.